we're alert to the fact that eating disorders are common in girls. And I think most people's picture of someone with an eating disorder is a painfully thin teenage girl with anorexia. And in fact, our data shows that, yes, that diagnosis has increased, but actually it's the more mixed presentations, sometimes with elements of bulimia, elements of restriction, elements of purging, but not straightforward anorexia or, or bulimia on, on its own that have really increased. So we need to be a bit wary of our preconceptions. And I worry particularly about boys and young men being overlooked because sometimes the picture with boys and young men is more about body shape than body size and sort of compulsive exercise and under eating and the level of distress and impairment and potential physical impacts are no less for the boys. So as with girls with neurodevelopmental conditions who tend to get overlooked, we need to make sure that we don't have the same but reversed gender disparity and that we recognise that those boys who are struggling need our support too.